Good morning, Hot Dogs, and welcome to the morning announcements. Weather, sports, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Picture day is near. FHS students and staff haven't had your picture taken? Are you new to FHS or do you need a picture retake when you're in luck? Picture day is October 14th. All sophomores and some juniors will be taking the PSAT on, Oct on October 13th. This test will begin promptly at 7.30. You will report directly to your testing location. Please check your emails regarding any important information regarding the test. Now to weather and sports. Good morning, hot dogs. It was 60 degrees when you woke up this morning. Expect rain today around 3 o'clock. Also a high of 75 degrees and a low of 57 degrees today. That's so for weather today. Now to sport with Colin. Thanks, Asusena. The girls volleyball team celebrated its seniors last night and unfortunately fell to Danville 0 to 3, losing all three sets. Set 1, 25 to 10, set 2, 25 to 15, and set 3, 25 to 12, placing them sixth in the Sagamore Conference. The volleyball team celebrated seniors Erica Pillion, Sydney Whitaker, Tara Martinez, Morgan Adamson, Maritza Jimenez, Galicia, Amber Houchin, and Bella Colby. Nelson was able to catch up with the tennis team early this week. Let's see what they had to say. I've been a relatively young team. The boys tennis team had an outstanding 2021 season. I was able to catch up with them. Let's see what they had to say. As a team, I think we did pretty good. We started off shaky, but we progressed every match after that, and everybody came back healthy. And we can always improve no matter like who we're learning from. And that's the biggest thing is that we improve and go up. I feel like our tennis season went pretty good, being the young team that we are, and we're just going to work hard this off season to come back even better. Personally, I feel like the season went pretty well. Had a lot of ups and downs. I mean, definitely a lot of struggles, uh, but we definitely got through it, and we're just going to keep getting better. My plans for next season is to become a more solid all-around player and be consistent more often and encouraging my teammates and becoming a leader for everyone around. My plans for next season is to become a better player all around and just to help our lead, lead our team to be the best that we can be. Congratulations to the tennis team on a great season. Now let's send it back to Nelson with football. The football team faces a conference rival, the North Montgomery Chargers tonight for senior night. The theme will be blackout for seniors and white for underclassmen. Kickoff is at 7, doors open to the public at 6. If you're unable to make it tonight, the game will be streamed live right here on the Hot Dog Network and the ISC Sports Network. Remember dogs, kickoff is at 7. Be there or be square. Thanks Nelson. That's all for sports. Now back to your hosts. This weekend, happy birthday to Vanessa Bravo Shelley, Eveline Dick, Julio Espinoza Lopez, Jennifer Hernandez Gomez, Austin Henry, Jose Bautista Ventura, and Yesenia Nieves. The NHS is sponsoring Trunk or Treats. Here is a video with more information from their president, Taylor Knox, and their vice president, Lexi Faust. Hello, hot dogs. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Lexi, and I am the vice president of service for the NHS chapter here at Frankfurt High School. Today, I'm here with Taylor, who is our president. One of the main goals of NHS is to give back to our community through multiple annual service projects. This fall, our chapter is planning to hold a trunk or treat event to do just that. The idea behind the trunk or treat is going to be that instead of kids going door to door to trick or treat, they will go from trunk or trunk of our cars instead. We are asking any FHS student who wants to join us to help serve our community in this service project to meet us at the gravel lot by the tennis courts at 4 p.m. on October 30th to begin lining up and decorating our cars. Please form a group of no more than three people to represent each car. Each group must supply the candy for their own trunk and it must be individually wrapped. Other than that, we encourage you to decorate your car trunk and of course, dress up. Per usual, costumes must be school appropriate. Starting at 5 p.m., you will simply hand out candy to the youth in our community who attend. As they make their way from car to car, trunk or treating will end at 7 p.m. This is such a fun way to give back to our community and NHS would love to include our FHS students in making this event memorable. Please talk to an NHS member or contact Mrs. Hale if you have any questions. In the meantime, don't forget to help us spread the word to the younger kids in our community. We hope to serve our community with you soon. 
What a great cause for the kids and also a good way to get in service hours. Club sponsors and students, St. Matthew's Preschool needs student volunteers to help with their pizza fundraiser on November 6th from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. Students can sign up in the main office with Ms. Debris. That is all for announcements. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe.